Hey, how's it going today, everybody? My name is Will Trent with The Filmmaker's Code, and today we're talking about how to slate. Now, before we learn how to slate, we gotta learn what the slate is for. The main point of a slate is to sync sound. Because audio is recorded separately, the audio must be synced with the video. As you can see, when we click the slate together, we get a spike in the audio waveform and we match the two together in post-production. Your second AC is usually the one to slate. So the slate contains tons of different pieces of information and there are lots of different kinds of slates to choose from and there are some that contain too much info and some are just for looks. However, every good slate should contain the following information. Your roll, your scene, and your take. You'll see that some slates have like four or five slots for you to write things. Only these three things, the roll, the scene, and the take, is all you need. The roll is what card or reel of film you're using. The scene is what scene you're shooting and take, which take you're using. The rest of it, kind of straightforward, but good to know still. Prod means production, which is the name of the film that you're shooting. Director, which is the director. Camera, who's the cam op or DP. Cam, the smaller one, is which camera you're seeing through. FPS, which is what frame are you shooting at? And the date, which is the date. The stuff at the bottom is where it gets kind of interesting. You're gonna box off whatever is applicable to your shot. Interior or exterior, whether your shot is inside or outside. Day or night, which is whether your shot is at day or night. Pay attention here. Sync means that sound is being recorded and you will sync the sound. MOS means motor only sync, which means there is no sound being recorded, and we'll explain how to slate for no sound in a second. So what do you write on the slate? First, roll is always marked with a letter. The card may be marked with A or B or C. This roll should also correspond to the camera as well. So card A should go with camera A, card B should go with camera B, etc. Now, if you're only working with one camera, then it's easier on you. Just write whatever your SD card or card or red mag, whatever form of media you're working with, write it here. Second, scene. The scene always has a number followed by a letter. The number indicates what scene you're shooting, whereas the letter is what shot it is. The first shot of the scene is obviously A, then you continue out to the alphabet for every shot. One A, one B, one C. Uh, skip I and O because they can look like ones and zeros. Then the take, which is obvious, what take you're doing. Now as a second AC, you should be ready to slate the shot when you hear the words pictures up. The minute you hear it is where you need to already be in position. Where you hold the slate is obviously important as well. You need to make sure that you hold it in a position where the camera can see the scene, the take, and the roll information, and obviously the slate itself. The best place to hold the slate is where the focus of the shot is. It can be on an object, it can be in front of an actor's face. If it's a wide shot, then just in front of the camera. And now the part you are all waiting for, how do we read a slate when slating? This honestly differs across all sets that you go on, but this is how we do it. Remember, middle, right, left. Scene, take, roll, middle, right, left. First, you'll say the number of the scene, which is in this case one, and then for the letter, think of a word that clearly starts with that letter. Don't say something like Issa Rae for letter G. But that word starts with G in Japanese. We don't speak Japanese. Also, don't say words that sound exactly like the letter. Don't say B for B. So you can be boring and go with the Alpha, Beta, Charlie, Delta, or you can have some fun and think of a cool word, which again, clearly starts with the letter on the slate. For A, we can say Apple. Uh, first student of Filmmaker's Code, Felicity, told me her favorite was Arctic. I really like that one. We can say one Armageddon, one Aliens, whatever. Then it's take. It's whatever number it is. In this case, it's take one. Now, this is the part that everyone gets wrong. It's not roll A, it's a mark, not a roll, not roll A or mark A, it's a mark. Always end it on mark. Sometimes if you only have one slate but have multiple cameras, A, B mark may be written on the roll. Then all you gotta say is A, B mark, and then you sync. So to demonstrate reading a slate, one Arctic, take one A mark. You click the slate and then you walk off. The next thing you gotta understand is soft sticks. There are gonna be moments where you're gonna have to slate really close to an actor's face. What you don't wanna do is slate hard because it'll take them out of their moment. What you need to do after you call your slate and before you click is to say soft sticks. In this case, one Arctic, take one A mark, soft sticks. Nice light clap. This notifies the editors in post that they're gonna have to really listen for that slate. Second six is called whenever the slate was not seen in the shot, like this. In that case, the DP will call second sticks, raise it up, ACs will say second sticks. So demonstration, one Articuno, take one A mark. Oh, second sticks, second sticks. This tells the editors that the first clap was a dead clap and the second clap is the one they need to sync to. Now, if the shot is MOS, you're gonna erase sync and then you're gonna circle MOS. 
You'll now place your fingers in between the clappers like so, read your slate, and walk off. This tells the editors that there is no sound, they don't have to worry about trying to find it, it's not lost, etc. Another tip when slating, say it clear but fast. Don't drag it out. One apple, take one, A mark. One more tip, you should start slating after about five seconds after you hear sound speed. So that's how we slate. However, you're gonna hear it very differently across all professional film sets. The way that I hear the AC slate on the show Walker is that the person slating a camera says the number of cameras and then says a mark, they slate. Then the following ACs will simply say their mark and then slate right after. It sounds something like this. Three cameras, A mark, B mark, Charlie mark. We don't do this because in post, we wouldn't know what audio file we'd be working with and which clip to sync it to. Uh, they probably have some sort of file sorting system built into their recorders or some voodoo magic, I don't know. Again, what we just talked about is how we slate for our shots. And now that you know how to slate for our way, here are several examples of us slating on the field. Two Apple, take one A mark. A Captain, take two A mark. Two Baloney, take one A mark. Six Flipper, take one A mark, soft sticks. Team one, take one A mark. Nine Coriolis, take one A mark. Three Candy, take one A mark. Three elephant, take one A-mark. Three fortune, take one A-mark. Three bacon, take two A-mark. Five domino, take one A-mark. Five balcony, take one A-mark. 